After reading some of your feedback and working on ways to improve the workflow, I've now added a new Vision 3 Balance Negative as part of the color suite. You'll find a new saturation base with cleaner tones in the shadows, highlights, and skin tones, which will bring a more natural color and contrast response to the prints and Cineon outputs. I've also made some minor changes to the power grade within the Cineon output and the default look choice. I've created a new Discord community for everyone that has purchased FV Pro. This will be a great place for anyone looking for support, dropping suggestions, showcasing projects, or even networking. I will also be using this to drop any upcoming news or random grades that I work on. When downloading the new files, they are now split up into three different folders, the DaVinci Resolve, Premiere Pro, and the in-camera monitoring LUTs folder. I've split them up to mitigate any issues you may have had with downloading the full package. To install the new version in DaVinci Resolve, you have two options. You can open up the DaVinci Resolve and you can go ahead and just copy and replace the current FilmVision Pro folder you already have in the LUT folder. Or you can go in here, go under negative and select these two new balanced negatives, copy these, and then just place them inside of your current negative folder. Once you've done either of those, you can go ahead and just update list and save. Now I have made some small changes to the power grade, so you can get rid of the old power grades, right click, import, find your downloaded version 1.1 DaVinci Resolve folder, click through, and go over to power grade version 1.1. Once you're in here, you can just go ahead and select all three DPX files and import. Once you've done that, you're all set. Now let's take a look at the new changes. So we'll go ahead and apply the grade. Now the two new negatives are Vision 3 Balance Negative and Vision 3 Balance Negative High Density. Let's quickly see the difference between the old 500T and the new Balance Negative. These two new negatives will yield cleaner results compared to 500T and 250D. Let's go with Balance Negative. Let's quickly grade this. We're going to cool it off a bit. Go under Exposure. Raise it to stop. Go under texture, I'll go ahead and disable this. And there we go. There are some very subtle changes to the Cineon node as well. And that, along with the new negative, will give you new and different results. I basically just removed some of the green tint that was present in the previous Cineon output. Here's another image. Apply. This is red log footage. Let's cool this off. Leave it somewhere around there. And let's quickly see what the 500T looks like in comparison. And what this new high density version looks like. I hope you enjoy these new changes. And if you have any questions, feel free to join the new Discord group and we can discuss them there.